If I'm a dog with a tail clip, it don't wag. It's the same thing with the government, it don't wag. Either you're right or you're wrong, and I'm gonna look in your eye and tell you you're wrong, and with no fear. I'm a type of person that uh, when I go out and tell somebody something, I'm thinking some value, added values behind that. And, and, and I went across the country and told all these old folks that I looked in their eyes and that we had a, the black farmers lawsuit was going to remedy that, the, the, the issues that the black farmers been going through with for years. Even my dad had to go through things. And here we are uh, in one of the most corrupt lawyers, corrupt uh, Justice Department and FHA set up. It wasn't about the money, it's about trying to uh, take uh, the land. This is a land thing, this ain't about no money. Because it was about money, they'd have been crying about the $5 billion they spent. But they ain't, nobody care about that. All they want to do is take the land. And that's, that's the issue that we face with. We advocated for full tax relief on Track B claims and Track A claims uh, because we had said that uh, to our parties that uh, there is no way that all the suffering that we done been through with over the years that uh, the black farmers need their uh, debts written off, we need the tax relief, and all the loans that we had, all of them, is being, uh, uh, we were supposed to be made whole. That was the whole issue, to be made whole, not give, cut an arm off, to be made whole. And to be made whole is taxes, land, and debt relief, those three things. Those were the major issues. Because for that, either one out of place, you be in the situation like we are right here today. What I'm doing in foreclosure debt, one of the largest lawsuits in history, and they done spent X by my dollars, uh, taxpayers' money, and it was designed to make black farmers whole, not to make lawyers feel too rich, not to give a, somebody who was riding, who in uh, New York City some way, get $50,000 to get a new pair of boots and a new truck. I mean, it was designed to keep black farmers on the land, but it, it didn't do that. And the whole conspiracy was to take black farmers' land. Our personal experience, you know what I mean, is um, if it had worked like it's supposed to, then we would have had uh, more black farmers still in business today and less land loss. And it's, it didn't work for us. The only thing we're trying to do now is trying to keep the taxes paid. And uh, cause if you don't pay the taxes, you automatically get wiped out. And to uh, try to uh, 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 keep doing the appeals to uh, continue to hold on to our land. Because if you ain't got nothing in the court, they're going to come there and automatically foreclose on And that's the situation we've been, been, uh, been fighting for all these years. What I think could be done right now is that they could, to make the black farmers whole again, to, out of all this suffering, to return our land back. And no taxes, and make our black farmers whole again. Uh, you can never be paid for your suffering, but you know, from what we, 20 years, what we have been through, uh, how can you measure up frustration enough that you had kidney failure? How can you measure up frustration of my wife uh, had a nervous breakdown? How can you measure up? There's no money can, can measure up that. 